Welcome to Bite Size Piano. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to play the accompaniment part to Willow by Taylor Swift. So I'm looking to what the guitar part is doing because it's a more guitar based song. There is piano parts, there are piano parts in there, but they don't really do much in terms of accompanying yourself on the piano. So we're going to look to that and try to make it sound as much like what's on the track as possible on the piano. And um, I've left the full chords and lyrics everywhere down below as well, so go and check those out if you find them useful. I'll attempt to sing each section as well. This one is in the key of E minor, so on the screen now are all the notes of the scale of E minor. So E natural minor. And here is middle C for as a reference point. The lowest note I'm going to play is this C. I think the highest note I'll play is this G. So I'm going to teach both hands at the same time. Blue, orange. We'll do the intro first and the intro makes up the verses as well. The guitar is breaking up chords so we can do that as well. And we've got these like hammer-ons. Just kind of doing that. So the left hand is going to go E. You need to be able to play all those at the same time, it's breaking up. So if you can't stretch the octave, it doesn't matter because you're playing the notes individually. So just roll your wrist. And then we're going to play um, second inversion of E minor. So B, E, G. And then you're going to use your fourth finger to play the F sharp like twice. So we have. And then it moves down to D, A, D, dad. And then the right hand, it moves down to, well, you're just gonna extend your thumb to A. And we're gonna play second version of D major, which is A, D, F sharp. And play that and then play the E twice. That goes. So from the E minor, have the C, so you're going to play C, G, C, like that, and then we're going to play uh, C and F sharp, and then E twice, and then I'm going to play a C and a G with C, and we've got this C, B, A, B, C, I'll do that again. That's the intro. So do all the intro again. And then you repeat that again for the verse. Uh, it goes through it two times. So I'm just going to continue. I'm like the water when you shoot. Just quickly before we continue, if you are enjoying the video so far, please consider hitting that like button and say hi in the comments section below. If you're brand new here, please consider subscribing, you know where the button is, and make sure to hit that notifications bell so you're notified every time I upload a new tutorial and you can be the first to learn. I've left a load of playlists in the description as well to get you started. I hope you enjoy the rest of the tutorial and let's continue. We're going to do a similar-ish thing, so I, I really listened to what the guitar part was doing. We've still got this going on, the G to the F sharp. So now we're up to a G, you're going to play G, D, G, and then we've got 
first inversion of G major, which is B, D, G, and then play the F sharp twice. And then you're gonna move your thumb to A, and we've got this bit again, but, but the G and the F sharp, like that. We've got an A, E, A, and then you're effectively going to play a C major chord in the right hand. So this makes an A7 chord. Play the F sharp twice. And then you come down to the E, B, E, and then I just sort of played it like that. So that E minor chord there, and break it up. So I'll do all that again, so from the start of the chorus. And then we're into the second verse, which we're going to play the same way as we did the first verse. Life was a willow and it bent right to your wind. twice as long this time. The moment you say, the less I know, wherever you stray, I follow, I'm begging for you to take my hand, wreck my plans, that's my man, know that my train could take you home, anywhere else is follow, I'm begging for you to take my hand, wreck my plans, that's my teach you what's in this bit first. It goes to B minor, so we've got B, F sharp, B, then I'm going to play D and F sharp, and then B, A, G, so like that. And then you're going to play that E minor chord with the E, B, E in the, in the left hand. So I'll do it again. she starts singing 
after that. And then here we have a similar thing, but it's based around this A minor chord. So we're going to play A, E, A, C and E, and then the B, A, G. So this keeps occurring in the bridge. So, and then to first inversion of G major. And then it alternates between the B minor and E minor, A minor, G major, alternates. So that's all on the screen there. So that's all that really the bridge is doing if we listen to the guitar part. to a third verse, so same as before. Wait for the signal and I'll meet you after dark. Show me the places where others gave you scars. Now this is an open showcase. I guess I should have known from the look in your face. Every bait and switch has a word. to the chorus again, but you're going to play it four times through. to the outro. I hope you enjoyed it and that it's useful. If you'd like to leave a piano tutorial request, you need to click on this video, which takes you through to my official request space. You do need to be subscribed. All requests are noted and considered. So I look forward to seeing you over there.